In this video, we will demonstrate changing from a 7mm drive head to a 15mm drive head. We'll also swap out the V-nails. The drive head size needs to be coordinated with the size of the V-nails. We want to switch off pin pushing. This releases the pushing tension on the V-nail stick. It allows you to be able to remove the stick easily. Once you've turned off pin pushing, you need to disconnect the air hose from the machine for safety reasons. Now we will change the V-nails from the smaller 7mm size to the 15mm size. When you insert the stick into the machine, notice that the adhesive needs to be at the top of the stick. You can see how the stick flexes. Make sure the pointed end is in the right direction too, facing towards the back of the machine. If you break the stick, don't worry, just make sure that you insert that shorter piece in the right direction also. Now we will change from the 7mm drive head to the 15mm drive head. Loosen the drive head retaining bolt with the Allen wrench provided. Use the magnetic stick to clear away any stray V-nails. Don't use compressed air to spray the V-nails out unless you are wearing protective goggles, and even then it's dangerous. Grab the 15mm head and drop it into position. Take your wrench and take the slack out of the bolt. Finalize the tightening with 1 8 turn of the wrench. Now you're ready to take on that thicker molding with the longer V-nails.